Okay, how to differentiate this three function? Logarithmic, exponential and trigonometric function. First, we look at the derivative of logarithmic function. Okay, logarithmic function is the inverse function to the exponential function. Okay, for example, okay, if 64 equal to 2 to the power of 6. 2 to the power of 6. This is in exponential function power. 2 to the power of 6. Okay, then log. We have log, log 64 base 2. 64. Base 2 is equal to 6. Okay, this is in the logarithmic function. Is uh, in log log base two. Okay, figure figure one illustrate the the graph for logarithmic function. This is the graph for log, logarith logarithmic function. So, what is the graph for exponential function? Here we look at. Okay, let's extend this uh, x axis. Okay, we look at this this log, the straight line uh, for natural log. Okay, if we want to sketch the exponential graph, it is the inverse of log. The graph for log. So this is the graph for exponential. Dia nampak tak? Contoh. Which is the inverse of uh, log, log function. Okay, we will learn how to sketch this log or exponential function in, in the next topic. Chapter... Chapter 3, 3 or 4. Chapter 3. Okay, in this chapter, we focus on how to differentiate the log and exponential function. Okay, now we look at the theorem. Okay, how to differentiate this log function. Okay, theorem number 1, differentiate ln x. Okay, ln x is equal to 1 over x. Ln x ni log, log x base 10. Log x base 10. Is equal to 1 over x. Okay, the second theorem. Okay, differentiate ln fx. Okay, fx is of uh, any any function. Okay, ln fx. So, it's equal to 1 over fx. The function of fx. Okay, multiple with differentiate. We differentiate uh, this function fx. Okay, for example, we have y equal to ln... 5x square okay, plus 2. Okay, we have this function ln fx. This one is fx. So, we want to differentiate y. Okay, so, dy over dx is equal to okay, 1 over fx, function fx. So, 1 over 5x square plus 2. And then multiple with, okay, we differentiate uh, the function of fx. Differentiate f. So, 10x. x over 5x squared plus 2.
Okay, boleh. So sebenarnya untuk uh, theorem number one ni derive from uh, theorem number two lah. So this one, uh, the function fx is equal to x. Again, fx is equal to x. So we differentiate x is equal to 1 times 1. That's why I'm going to put 1 over x. Okay, number 3. Okay, differentiate log x base a. Okay, is equal to 1 over x. 1 over function x. x. fx. Okay, times ln a. Ln base a. Ni base ni. Ln a. Okay, and then number 4, differentiate log fx base a is equal to 1 over fx. 1 over function fx. Okay, times ln a. Okay, a is the base of this log function. Okay, multiple with, we differentiate the function f. f prime. For example, kat sini y, yeah, function y equal to log 2, 3x minus 1. <coughs> okay, we want to differentiate this uh, log function. So, dy over dx is equal to, okay, 1 over Okay, the function fx, 3x minus 1, multiple with ln, okay, base, base 2, okay, times, okay, we differentiate this function f, so 3, 3 over ln 2. Okay, ln 2 ni sebenarnya constant lah. Ayah boleh tekan calculator kan, takkan dapat nilai ni. Ni adalah constant. <coughs> so, there are four theorem in uh, derivative of logarithmic function. Okay, we look at example 1. Okay, find dy dx of a function y equal to 3 ln x squared plus 2x. Okay, so we use this. Uh, we want to find y prime is equal to 3 over this function f. 3 over f. So y prime equal to. 3 over function f. So x square plus 2x. And then we differentiate f. We find f prime. So 2x plus 2. This is f prime. About 6x plus 6 over x square plus 2x. <coughs> okay, ada soalan tak? Uh, derivative of log function. The example two is the exercise. Okay, so exercise ni uh, involve yang sebelum ni lah yang you all dah belajar. Untuk uh, topik sebelum ni eh. Product rules and quotient rules. Uh, ini penting eh untuk uh, derivative, find the derivative. So ni kena ingat lah. So f prime g. Plus F 
g prime. Okay, Gaussian rule. F prime g minus f g prime over g square. Yang ini apa perlu ingat? Dia punya rules. Kita akan apply kan. Okay, we look at example 2A. <coughs> okay, yang ni Differentiate y with respect to x Differentiate ni lah So you get ln Okay, ni sebenarnya boleh guna Ni boleh terus je lah differentiate kan So ln 4 Okay, plus Okay, 4 Okay, ni kita gunakan product rules lah kan Okay, differentiate ln x Is 1 over x So equal to ln 4 Plus 4 over x Okay, ln 4 ni uh, Boleh tekan ke kereta dia akan dapat nilai lah Ber, Akan dapat constant <coughs> Dia adalah constant Okay B Dewa over dx <coughs> okay, 1 over function f, 3x. Okay, and then differentiate this f, 3, equal to 1 over x. Okay, think. Okay, yang ni melibatkan exponential. Kita tengok lah exponential. Exponential. Okay, yang ni, ni boleh kan? Yang ni. D. Y equal to 5 plus ln x square plus 3x plus 12. Okay, differentiate ni 0. So, differentiate ln 1 over function. Okay, then differentiate fx. Okay. Okay. So, yang mana? Yang ni dah. Okay. Yang ni kita tengok nantilah untuk uh, untuk uh, trigonometric function. Okay. Ni, yang ni you boleh cari sendiri. Okay. Ada soalan tak yang ni? Saya nak tunjukkan untuk uh, exponential pula. Nanti exponential kita boleh buat yang ni lah. Ln exponential x. Okay, ada soalan tak? F, G, H boleh try sendiri ya? Okay, madam. Hmm. E, e ni pun lah. 
Boleh madam. Okay. Okay next. Okay is derivative of exponential function. Okay there are two theorem for exponential function. Derivative of exponential function. Okay the first one. Differential exponent to power of x. Okay is equal to exponent to power of x. Okay second theorem. Differential exponent to power of u. Where u is any function. Function, for example, function in term of f, fx. Okay, is equal to exponent to power of u. Okay, times du over dx. Means we differentiate the function f with respect to x. For example, we have. Uh, x point y equal to exponent of 3x cubed minus 2x. <clears throat> okay, this is this uh, function u. Eh? We want to differentiate this function. So dy over dx is equal to okay, exponent 3x cubed minus 2x. Okay, saling balik dah ni. Exponent u. Then multiple with. Okay, we differentiate this function. So, 9. X square minus 2. So, kena pengen ni lah. So, I did, uh, there are two theorem for exponent. Exponential function. Okay, kita tengok yang contoh tadi. C. Ln exponent x plus ln x square. Okay, we want to differentiate ln. I'm going to count your ln. So, ln is 1 over this function fx. So, number exponent x. And then we want to differentiate. Ni, we want to find f prime. Lah. f prime berapa kan? Okay, so, we differentiate exponent x. Lah. Exponent x. Times 1 kan? Kat sini. Okay, plus 1 over x square. Then differentiate x square. This 2x. So, we have 1 plus 2 over x. Okay, kita tengok contoh lain untuk eksponen. <coughs> okay, example 3. Find y prime of 3 exponent x plus square root 2 pi x. Okay, so differential exponent x. 3 exponent x plus. Okay, ni simple lah. Okay, B, exponent 3x plus 1. Okay, so exponent. First step. Okay, uh, salin balik. Exponent 3x plus 1. And then multiple with, okay, we differentiate the power. 3x plus 1. So, 3. That's where I'm going to put 3 exponent. 3x plus 
Okay. Okay, as a, uh, example four ni. Okay, ni melibatkan, ni ada melibatkan apa tu? Trigonometric function. Yang ni kan. Okay, kita tengok yang, yang tak melibatkan dulu. Okay, kita tengok yang F ni. Okay, y equal to exponent. Okay, differential exponent to power 3 plus ln x. Ha, kita saya ada balik. Exponent 3 plus ln x. Okay, and then multiple with okay, di differential ni, function. Okay, 0 plus, okay, ln x is 1 over x. Okay, plus. Okay, differential ln is 1 over this function. Ni function fx lah. So exponent 3x plus 1. Okay, then multiple with okay, we differentiate fx ni. So ni involve uh, exponential lah. So differentiate fx. Okay, differentiate exponent is Exponent 3x and then multiple with 3 and differentiate 3. Okay, plus uh, differentiate 1 is 0. So, I can open it. Okay, yang lain ni kita tengok uh, ni. Next. Uh, derivative of trigonometric function. 2.4.3 <coughs> Okay, this is the table for derivative of trigonometric function. Okay, number one. Okay, differentiate sine x. Okay, is equal to cos x. You can kena ingat lah ni, enam ni. Okay, number two, differentiate cos x is equal to negative sin x. Okay, number three, differentiate tangent x is equal to secant square x. Number four, differentiate cosecant x. is equal to negative cosecant x cotangent x. Okay, number 5. Differentiate secant x is equal to secant x tangent x. And last one. Differentiate cotangent x is equal to negative cosecant square x. So, 6, 6 derivative of trigonometric function ni. Uh, you all perlu tahulah kat sini. Biasa kalau sebelum ni pun ha, diberilah dalam list of formula ni. Tapi awak perlu tahulah untuk memudahkan ni. Okay ada soalan tak? Okay ni. Biasa tiga ha, untuk derivative ni ha, dia melibatkan semualah tiga eh, exponential, logarithmic and trigonometric function. Jadi tiga benda tu ha, dia ada dia berkait. Dan product rule dan question rule pun you perlu tahu. Okay, ada soalan? Tak ada, madam. Tak ada, madam. Tak ada.
Okay, kita tengok contoh yang tadi ni. A. Okay, y equal to exponent. Okay, main kat sini uh, differentiate exponent x Exponent fx kan So kita salin balik lah exponent 5x plus cos x Okay and then differentiate uh, Differentiate dalam dia ni fx So differentiate 5x is 5 Okay, and then plus uh, differentiate cos x is negative sin x. So, ni boleh sampai sini ataupun boleh lah nak expand kan 5 exponent of x plus. Okay. Okay, ni B. Okay, B ni boleh, boleh, boleh ni boleh try sendiri eh. Yang ni semua boleh try sendiri. Okay, ada soalan tak? Takat ni. Tak ada, madam. Tak ada eh. Ni boleh try sendiri eh. Okay, Cikgu. madam. Ni yeah, contoh lain lah. Okay, example 5. Example uh, exercise for trigonometric function. Hmm. Ni yang simple lah kan. Okay, ada yang kena melibatkan. Okay, yang ni melibatkan ln. You are kena applykan ln. Derivative of ln. Okay, yang ni kena, uh, number 7 ni kena apply kan product rules ni. Product rules. Number 8 tu sama. Yang 2. Product rules. Number 9. Product rules. Okay, number 10 ni you are perlu tukar in term of power lah. Square root ni kan. Power apa? Y equal to exponent x sine x to power of 1 over 2. Over 2. Hmm. Okay, yang ni pun, ni pun ada uh, melibatkan apa tu? Product rules juga. Apa sama? Product rules. Okay. Contoh mana yang nak uh, perlu tunjukkan? Ini tak ada jawapan. Nombor tiga ni tu. Dia ada guna quotient rule juga eh. Nombor tiga, ah, nombor tiga ada question rule. Ah, UV ni. FG kan. FG. Ah, ni guna question rule. Okay, cuba kita tengok nombor tiga eh. Okay, ni menggunakan quotient rule lah. Kena ingat balik yang product product rule and quotient rule. Product 
Sebentar dulu apa dia? Okay, first, <coughs> okay, dy over dx. Okay, first kita, kita differentiate ln. So ln rules dia 1 over fx. Function ni kan. So 1 over cos x over x. <coughs> okay, ni boleh eh. Okay, and then multiple with differentiate function yang ni, dalam ni. Okay, so untuk differentiate ni kita gunakan quotient rule lah. Sebab dia melibatkan division kan. Ni f over g lah. F over g prime. So f prime g, f ni atas lah. So differentiate cos x is negative. Sin x. Okay and then x. Darab x. Okay minus cos x. Okay differentiate g. 1. Over x square. Okay tinggalkan dulu lah ni. Plus. Okay differentiate yang ni. So 1 over x cos x. Okay. Then differentiate yang ni. Function yang ni. F1. So kita gunakan product rules lah. Sebab dia menggunakan x. X multiple with cos x kan. Dan kita guna product rules. So f prime is 1. Cos x. Okay. Plus x. Okay, differentiate cos negative sin x. Then boleh simplify lah kat sini. So, okay, jadi x cos x. Ni ada x square. Boleh cancel. Cost ni pun boleh cancel kan. So, I can dapat negative 2x sin x cos x x cos x Okay, ni pun boleh cancel. Negative 2 Okay, sign over cos is tangent. Tangent x. Dekat ni lah. Lagi saya tak kena, kena ingat yang ni lah. Hmm. Yang tadi product roof. Dengan tadi. Uh, sign over sign over cos dengan tangent cos over sign cotangent
Okey, ada soalan tak? Boleh faham? Boleh madam. Okey, yang, yang lain ada tak mana yang nak, nak tunjukkan ni? Ni tak ada jawapan ni. Saya, saya, saya bagi jawapan dah ni. Tak ada jawapan ni. Nombor sebelas ni tu. Tak ada jawapan ni. Ya, saya tulis jawapan dulu ni. Tak boleh boleh cek sendiri dah ni. Jika tak ada dah kan. Jawapan dia pandai panjang ni. Sebelas ni panjang dia punya. Tadi nak, uh, tadi ada tanya nombor apa? Sebelas eh? Haa, uh, Madam. Tanya nombor sebelas. Haa, buatlah sebelas. Kita buat sesama ni sebelas. Panjang dia punya. <coughs> okay, sebelas. Soalan ni Y equal to sum. Okay, ni kan. Betul tak? Soalan dia. X sin X. Hmm. Okay, so dy over dx is equal to. Okay, first tak tengok dulu yang kat sini. Function ni, sin. So sin, uh, differentiate sin apa? 
cos cos kan ha, cos tu je lah cos salin balik semua yang dalam ni sin exponent x sin x ok lepas tu ok differentiate yang dalam ni ni sebenarnya boleh guna uh, chain rule ni tapi ni saya uh, ni kita buat Buat guna yang biasa lah. Ok, differentiate ni. Ln sin exponent x sin x. Differentiate ln is 1 over ni lah. Sin exponent x sin x. Ok, then. Ok, differentiate dalam dia ni. Sin exponent. Sin exponent is? Cos. Cos lah. Cos exponent. Salin balik. Cos exponent. Sin x. Okay. Lepas tu differentiate dalam ni. Exponent ni. Okay. Dia differentiate exponent. Salin balik kan exponent kan. Exponent x sin x. And then differentiate. Ha, ni ni. Ni kena guna product rules lah. Okay, differentiate f. 1 so sin x. Okay, plus x. Okay, differentiate sin cos. Cos x. Okay, yang ni Okay, yang ni, bo ni boleh Yang ni boleh simplify ni kan Sign, uh, cos over sign Ni cos over sin ni. Cotangent. Ha, jadi cotangent kan ni. ni. Jadi cotangent lah. So cotangent. This one x sin x. Darab salin balik ni. Exponent x sin x. Salin lah ni. Sin x plus x cos x. Hmm. Tengok lah benda ni. Exponent, cotangent, exponent. Okay, tak boleh simplify kan lagi ni. Ya, macam tu je yang metode jawapan ni. Ha, macam ni je lah. Ini dah, ni semua darab kan. Oh, okay. Di mana boleh simplify ni? Simplify lah. Yang ni tak boleh ni sebab uh, cos ni dia punya function yang cos function ni semua ni. Ni trigonometric lah ni. Combination of trigonometric ni trigonometric dengan exponential. Okay, ada soalan tak? 11 tadi, okay. 11 ni. Okay. 
Yang ni boleh uh, boleh juga kalau nak applykan nanti chain rule kalau belajar chain rule kan. Next subtopic. Untuk point 5 nanti chain rule. Kalau chain rule ni boleh boleh pecahkan kepada beberapa function lah kat sini. Untuk y equal to sin u. Ni boleh u. V, W Empat pecah kepada tiga function U, V, W Okay, nombor dua belas tadi Dua belas ni pun panjang juga Dua belas <coughs> Depan nombor berapa sih? Okay. Kita okay, soalan yang ni kita tengok chain rule eh 2.5. Okay, normally chain rule we use to differentiate the uh, complicated function lah. Contoh tadi lah uh, example uh, 11 and 12 complicated function. Okay, so in chain rule, okay, we want to find dy over dx. So we have to uh, separate this function into two variable. Kat sini. Uh, kat sini uh, into two variable. Uh, let y equal to uh, u. Look at this example. Okay, let y equal to u to power of 14. Okay, we create a new function u kat sini, u to the power of 14. Okay, and then u equal to x square minus 3x cube. So, kat sini kita create a uh, new function lah, u kan. u, in term of u. y equal to u 14, u to the power of 14 and let u equal to x square minus 3x, 3x cube. Okay, so we... We differentiate, okay, y with respect to u. So we get 14 u to of 13. And we differentiate u with respect to x. So to x minus 9x square. Then we want to find dy over dx. So dy over dx is equal to dy over du multiple with du over dx. Ni kalau kita simplify, cancel akan dapat balik lah dy over dx kan. Okay, so we substitute the value dy over du. Okay, dy over du is 14 u to the power of 13. Okay, times d over dx is 2x multiple with 2x minus 9x square. Okay, then we substitute back the value of u. u equal to x square minus 3x cubed. So this final answer untuk ni. Dan saya kalau untuk chain rule ni dia ada uh, dia specific method lah. Uh, you all perlu gunakan chain rule yang ni. Perlu create lagi satu variable. Okay, example 7. Example 7. Find dy over dx. Okay, using chain rule. 
Okay, example A ni. Example A ni sebenarnya kita boleh differentiate uh, straight away kan. Kat sini. Boleh je terus cari dy over dx is equal to uh, differentiate secant apa? Secant x tangent. X tangent x kan. Ha, terus je boleh uh, straight away kita boleh terus je differentiate kan. Secant x x uh, 5x lah. Tangent x. Okay, then kita differentiate dalam ni. Times with differentiate 5x is 5. Dapat ni lah. 5 secant x tangent x. Okay, tapi soalan ni dia nak gunakan chain rule. Jadi awak mesti kena ikut lah dia punya method ni. So chain rule, kita gunakan chain rule. Nak kena let, let y equal to Kena let another variable lah, secant u Contoh secant u So u equal to 5x Masih kena tunjuk ni y, Let y equal to secant u, u equal to 5x Then we differentiate Okay, y with respect to u So dy over du Okay, secant u is secant u tangent u. Okay, differentiate u with respect to x is 5. Then, masukkan lah dy over dx is equal to dy over du multiple eh, du over dx. Masukkan secant u tension u times 5. Then substitute value u for 5 secant 5x tension 5x. Kan dapat sama lah macam yang tadi awak definition. Jadi biasanya untuk chain rule ni markah dia banyak lah sikit. Sebab dia ada tambah lagi satu variable kan. <coughs> okay. Okay madam. Madam okay. yang, yang F tu nak, nak cari yang U yang mana satu? Ni. Oh. Okay, kalau yang ada, yang kat sini kan ada uh, trigonometric function dia ada power ni kan power 3, lagi satu contohnya ni kan. Uh, kat sini awak uh, boleh apa tu, boleh modify dulu eh function ni. Dia akan jadi ni lah, dia akan jadi function ni lah. Hmm. Y sama dengan tangent uh, kuasa ni bawa, bawa keluar cos exponent x square hmm. tangent cube okay, yang ni dia akan jadi y sama dengan sin 3x cube contohnya f ni kan <coughs> F ni variable dia ada ada dua ada lah kan? Ada dua tiga. Atau tiga. Hmm. Boleh buat dua ataupun tiga. Untuk F, Y sama dengan tension. Dia depend. Kalau awak buat dua boleh, tiga pun boleh. So, boleh lah let Y equal to tension u tangent u cube kan so u sama dengan cos contohlah cos w w sama dengan exponent hmm. exponent v V kan. 
So V sama dengan X square. Kalau nak sampai 3 pun boleh. Kalau 3 buat je lah. Terus W sama dengan eksponen X square. Pun boleh juga kat sini. Ataupun nak tambah lagi satu. Nak create lagi satu variable pun boleh. Okay then uh, differentiate lah. Satu-satu ni kan. Uh, dy over du. <coughs> Tension U Square uh, Differentiate ni Second square U Second Square U Okay yang ni DU over DW Differentiate cos W is Negative Sin W Yang ni DW DV So exponent V Yang ni DV DX 2X Masukkan lah DY over D Masukkan je dulu. Okay, ni boleh buat ke depan dah kan? So, 6x lah. Tension. Oh, masukkan. Ni boleh buat, boleh uh, squarekan je lah kat depan lah. Uh, tangent square u. u is equal to cos w. Exponent x square. Second square U <coughs> Mana ada negatif saya dibawa ke depan je negatif Simplify. Ya, sebenarnya ni, ni, ni tak ada menyebabkan trigo kan. Boleh buat uh, pindah ke depan pun boleh. Sebenarnya X square. Yang mana menyebabkan trigo tu boleh letak kat, kat belakang. Tangent square cos x exponent x square times second square. Macam ni lah. Tak boleh nak expand kan. Eh tak boleh nak simplify lagi. Macam ni lah jawapannya. Macam ni. Ni exponent x square eh kat sini. Okay, ada soalan tak? 
Yang ni pun ni kena kuasa Kuasa tiga Nak nyanyi tukar kepada kuasa uh, Power one over two D and E ni Nak try lah ni sendiri Okay, ada soalan tak lagi? So, uh, untuk hari ini sampai sini je lah. Chain, chain rule. Tak ada. Jawapan, nak jawapan. Check ni medium. Jawapan ni, nak check, nak jawapan. Nak. Saya juga. Check ni. Ni A dah kan? A dah B. Saya betul sebelah sini lah. Nampak tak? Nampak. Ni B eh. Thank you. 